Parkour to me mainly is a way to express myself. Um, and it's also a way for me to help other people. I mean, everyone trains together. Um, it's almost a perfect society in a way. Um, and you always help each other. No one ever thinks, oh, you can't do this. It's always, hey, let me show you this. Or, you know, so it, it helps me to show the people my passion as well. My main training methods. Mm. <laughs> Just practice makes perfect. You never go for a massive jump, like, first off. Everyone always sees parkour as jumping from building to building, but no one ever does that. Well, sometimes we do, but that's only with practice. If, for example, it was a jump over a massive gap, we would take ourselves away from that situation and do a small jump and build it bigger and bigger until we know that we can make that jump. We wouldn't just go for it because, believe it or not, your mind doesn't let you. Like that. <laughs> nah, um, we do, we, we go to gyms, um, oftentimes there's foam pits, but, you know, we, we, a spongy floor tends to do the trick. Um, yeah and no, because it used to inspire me a lot more than it does now. Um, it used to, I used to see it as this thing, this is when I was progressing, this was when I was, well to be fair I'm always progressing, but this was when I was starting out in the practice. Um, I was watching YouTube videos and every everyone who could do all these amazing flips over massive gaps and jumping from roof to roof. Um, I was like, whoa, but nowadays I just, I, I, just, I just hope, nowadays I just hope that I, I inspire others.